So the next thing that you're going to want to explore instead of just shapes is also integrating text into your logo. And the best way that we can do that and also manipulate it is creating some kind of text with our typography tool here. We can adjust it with our character panel here by the size, the tracking, the leading of it, and also the paragraph spacing and the hyphenation of it down here if you're doing more text in paragraph type form. Choose a color, but you don't have to choose one right off the bat. And what you will do once you have all of your kerning, tracking, leading set in place is come up to type and create outlines. This will turn your text into actual shapes where you can see that you have anchor points. If I ungroup all of my letters, they become individual shapes that I can manipulate. If I want the B to be extra big, I can come in here and center it, make it big, however I want. But even if you want to get more creative and unique with how your letters look, select your A for your white arrow, and maybe you want to make the shape of it very different, very unique. Um, we can take and make some arrow wings or something like that. And you start to have something that can identify with what your actual brand is and speak to the aesthetic of it, the service that's provided for it, and uh, make something that's identifiable with outsiders, not just a plain old text, but something that's quite unique.